There's a lot going on in today's video. We're even going to go thrifting. It's Dress Up Thursday and today's theme is Easter. The color blue, the color pink, or the color yellow. This little guy over here is um, wearing this cute little Easter outfit and I honestly forgot what his name is. You're bound to forget a name or two when you have this many kids. Little Johnny has his bunny fleece uh, snowsuit on. Got her toodles in her peep dress. Hunter wearing his little bunny set. Wesley and her bunnies. And here's Royal in his little outfit that has bunnies on it. He looks so cute. I know he likes that outfit. And those looking for a new baby to take home, make sure to head on over to the website in love with reborns 2011.org to check out this sweet baby girl who's available. Also, make sure to register your email with our website so you never miss out on our new merch or when dolls are available because we always send out an email letting you guys know. So here's our twins, and originally we were gonna do identical boys, but now we're gonna do a boy and a girl. So yay, so Joshua got a sister. So feel free to leave names for uh, Joshua's sister. I'm still going to use the outfits I picked up for them because I think they're very gender neutral. So that's Joshua and then that's the new baby, his sister. So we can get them coordinating outfits and matching outfits and get her some cute little headbands and bows for her hair. So next week's Dress Up Thursday's theme is share your favorite outfit. Put your baby in your favorite sleeper, favorite dress, favorite romper, favorite gown. Whatever you consider to be your favorite outfit, share your baby in that. Let's go thrifting, guys. We're going to Goodwill this time. They keep changing this place. It has changed so much again. This was not like this. That stuff was over here. They've changed it so much in the last month. It's crazy. This is where I always find my suitcase deals. That's a nice little suitcase. $4.97 Samsonite. Sometimes you can find new wave ovens here. Oh, I like that floral chair. It's only $9.09. Oh my gosh, it's so nice. Look at these beautiful chairs. How much are these? $9 each. These are nice. Yeah, that floral chair over there is really pretty. I was telling Jackie about that one. Look at those are nice bar stools. Look at this clear chair. Oh my gosh, this is an old chair. Oh, I love it, the vinyl. Jackie just saw some really cute photos up there. Look at that. Those cats sleeping in the books, those are adorable. Let's go see what they have in their baby clothes. But used pants at the Goodwill, $8.29. And these are just, well, these are work pants, but that's the set price for all pants. $8.29. Like, man, it's expensive. It's expensive. Even these. Are these $8.29 used pajama pants? Used leggings, $8.29. Kids pants are $4.09. Guess that's not too terrible, but I like $2 better. Okay, here's their baby section. Brand new little me sleeper. Is it nine bucks? No, it's three sixty nine. Not bad. Sometimes they'll put nine bucks on it if it's brand new. Like this brand new blanket. They want seven dollars and thirty eight cents. Right there. Like, come on, Goodwill. This is adorable. It's only three sixty nine for the whole little set. It's freaking mother care. You're coming home with me. Let's see what they have in their knick-knack area. This little dog votive is so cute. I swear I've seen those teddy bear cookie jars more than once at this store. I absolutely love these. We use these dishes all the time at home. Corningware. We're actually thinking about getting these. I need them for my herbs. Like, I make herb teas, and they don't have bags. You just put the herbs into the water so I was like I need containers now we're thinking about getting these which my new current tea I'm drinking is the fennel tea it's pretty interesting let's see what is down this aisle we've been finding some good stuff today oh look at that picture with the glasses that's pretty what dish is this that's not pyrex that's like that hard material look at that big old fish cookie jar <laughs> There's a Dorothy plate, Wizard of Oz. There she is, their little dog Toto right there. Look at 
Look at this corn salt and pepper shaker, and then that's probably for sugar. Oh, Corel, another brand we love. And these are only 25 cents, little teacups. Yes. That is Avon. so pretty. I got that Avon. You know oh, how I got you saw this, this one? Oh, you have that one? Yeah. Oh, the bowl. The Avon bowl. Oh, yeah, but yeah, I don't yeah. Have you this. don't have that thing. That is super pretty. Does it come with the, the sound of It must come together. Looks like it. Wow. Look at this Avon Genie um, bottle. That is pretty cool. Now we are at Valley Thrift. This is the one we don't go to that often, but they do have two of them. Ooh, look at those big old blue sandals. Let's go see what we can find. Sometimes I find baby bottles here and look at, oh my gosh, we found a bottle, big old bag of different bottles, but nothing I could use. Oh, there's another bag of bottles. Wow. Any vintage ones? No. Let's see what their toy room holds for us. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's a freaking disaster back here. I do not think I have ever seen it look like a dang tornado came through here. But is this a Care Bear car? This looks like a car for Care Bears. I was right, American Greeting, 1983. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna get that even though I don't have a Care Bear for it, I'm gonna find one. Look, it's got the star right there. It says love box for the radio. What the heck has happened here, guys? Do we just keep throwing toys out of here and make it worse? We're on our way to neighborhood thrift. We're not driving by it, I promise you that. We just have to flip around so we can park. You want to know who's the best at parallel parking when there's a car in front and a car behind? It's Jackie. There's a crib mattress. So, oh my gosh, that's a beautiful wood piece. 175 bucks. Wow, those are expensive. This place's furniture is always pretty steeply priced. Oh, how much is this? Yeah, see, $60. Like what? I, I could use that. Oh, this is a really cool piece too. Fifty dollars? Oh, one hundred and ninety. They're sectioning it out, so you're really looking at a big price. Always check these areas because they sell diapers. I'm hoping to find a pack of vintage diapers one day. Oh, I like those orange chairs. Each one's twenty-five bucks. Once before I was into collecting vintage stuff, there was a vintage vintage changing table, one from the seventies. It folded into a tall standing cube. It was the most amazing thing. It was right there. I keep hoping every time I come in here, I'm going to see it again. I got lots of Easter eggs. You guys should always check out these places first because it's cheaper than the store. Last time we were here, we found some pretty cool stuff. But um, that wasn't that long ago. I feel like this place doesn't stock up that frequently. I did find this vintage sleeper. It looks like a Carter sleeper. It's got a clock right there, but they cut the tag off. It's like in pickles size. Look at this porcelain doll. Her neck is really twisted. Let's help you out there. But her arm's a little bit broken. Whoa. <laughs> her name is Hillary. She's from 1987. There you go. Your neck should hurt less now. There's nothing going on in the girl area. I wish I had a use for that kitchen. Oh my god! We found Steffi! Oh wow, and her belly's in there, just no babies. Some of you are probably like, Steffi, yeah, you know what? I'm gonna put a link in my description below. Y'all need to go and click it. I have been birthing babies on TikTok. This is Steffi. She's been having a lot of babies over there, so if you wanna see the that footage, go click that um, link and then link to my account from there and watch the other videos with Steffi because she'd be popping out babies left and right. Here's some of their Easter bunnies they have here. Oh, and the Mickey basket. It's older. I don't know about that. Little Easter village. Those are some cute tea cup sets. This is their, you guys don't really see much back here. Well, this is like their glass area and yeah so anything pretty much glass goes over here they get some cute coffee mugs here like this one looks like it's cute Aww. 
Oh, look at those photos. Oh, that is so cute. Would, would it be weird to put someone else's kid up in the nursery? I mean, it's our. Those are so adorable. How could they? We don't need the teenage ones. That one almost looks like you. <laughs> that is so cute. We're taking them home with us, guys. So, what year do you think she was born? How cool is this? It's a Dudley's Press and Print Egg Coloring Stamp Set. And I was like, this looks vintage. Well, it is. Came out in 1994. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Remember to stay safe, stay positive. Don't give in to negativity. And we'll be back soon. Bye. Look what I found. Rainbow Bride. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. I also found the small version of her. Like, this version is so adorable. Strawberry shortcake. There's even trolls. Oh my gosh, this is all taking me back to childhood. Look at these guys. I love trolls. I love that one. Oh, and look at him with his blue eyes. He's so cute. Oh, there's a few of them you can collect. Oh my gosh, these guys are making me want to get one. Then there's this strawberry shortcake doll. Material troll, oh my gosh. Who used to collect trolls as a kid? Strawberry shortcake, a rainbow bright. Are you gonna run to Walmart and get these? I don't know how much they are because I'm not seeing any prices anywhere. But there's also something else cool here. Look at this, Monster High Polly Pocket. Like say what, how cool? Is that you've got Frankie, Dracula? So cool. Who's the one in the middle? The wolf? Claudine. Claudine.